Cats are complex creatures known for their mysterious ways, but beneath their enigmatic exteriors lies a sophisticated system of communication. Cats utilize a blend of vocal and non-vocal expressions to convey their emotions, intentions, and needs. Understanding these forms of communication can greatly enhance the relationship between cats and their owners, providing insights into their thoughts and feelings. Vocal Communications Cats have a wide range of vocalizations, each serving a different purpose and meaning. Here are some of the most common cat vocalizations. Meowing Unlike other vocalizations that are often reserved for cat-to-cat -cat interactions, meowing is primarily used for communicating with humans. Kittens meow to their mothers when they're cold or hungry, but adults generally use meowing to communicate with people. The tone, pitch, and frequency of a meow can indicate a cat's needs or desires, such as hunger, attention, or discomfort. Purring, often associated with contentment and relaxation, purring is usually heard when a cat is in a state of calmness or while being petted. However, cats also purr when they are in pain, stressed, or injured, using it as a self-soothing mechanism. The dual nature of purring can sometimes make it challenging to understand the exact reason without looking at the context of the situation. Chirping and chattering, this sound is commonly made when a cat is observing prey, such as birds or squirrels, typically from behind a window. Some believe this vocalization mimics the call of the prey or is an expression of frustration or excitement at not being able to chase the observed creature. Hissing and growling, these sounds are unmistakable expressions of annoyance, fear, or aggression. A hiss is often a warning to stay away, used when a cat feels threatened or is in a defensive posture. Growling can be heard during aggressive encounters with other cats or in response to a disturbing situation. Yowling, a loud, drawn-out moan that is usually a communication of distress, discomfort, or mating calls. It's more commonly heard in cats that are in pain, cats that are mating, or senior cats with cognitive dysfunction syndrome. Non-vocal communications. Cats also communicate extensively through body language, using their ears, tails, eyes, and body posture to signal their mood and intentions. Tail positioning. The position of a cat's tail can indicate its emotional state, a tail held high usually signifies happiness and confidence, while a tail tucked between the legs suggests fear or submission. A puffed-up tail indicates a frightened or agitated cat, and a slowly waving tail can signal focus and slight irritation. Ear movements. Cats' ears are highly expressive and can rotate up to 180 degrees. Ears that are forward show that a cat is alert and interested in what's happening around them. If the ears are flattened or pinned back, it indicates fear, aggression, or irritation. Eye contact, cats use their eyes to communicate trust and mood. Slow blinking at a human or another cat is often referred to as a cat kiss, a sign of affection and comfort. Conversely, a direct stare can be a challenge or threat, particularly if accompanied by dilated pupils. Body posture, a cat's body posture can convey a great deal about its feelings and intentions. An arched back with fur standing on end makes a cat look bigger and more threatening, which is a defensive reaction. On the other hand, a cat lying on its back exposing its belly may indicate trust and contentment, although this can also be a defensive posture. Conclusion Understanding the nuances of cat communication through vocal and non-vocal expressions enhances the bond between cats and their owners. It allows for a deeper appreciation of these fascinating creatures and enables owners to respond more effectively to their pets' needs. By paying attention to these signs, cat owners can create a more harmonious and understanding relationship with their feline friends, ensuring mutual respect and affection are maintained.